We're at North High School where tonight the Golden Raiders take on Green Bay East in their homecoming game. Alongside the reporter Joe Gulig, I'm Mike Martin. Joe, this is an important game for Sheboygan North. Yeah, they're right now. Uh, they're at uh, four and one or five and one, and uh, they get another win. They're guaranteed to be in the playoffs. So I think this is a, a really important game for them, and uh, I hope they're ready to play. I talked with uh, Trevor Cagle, one of the assistant coaches for North prior to the start, and uh, he was talking about hoping to uh, run the table of course, and uh, getting a home game. So that'd be pretty outstanding. That would really be good. They've got two tough games coming up against uh, Nasha and Oshkosh North. they got to get this one out of the way first, and I, I think they're they're ready for it. They look like they're, they're all set to go and uh, hoping for a good game tonight. Tyler Conrad, the uh, starting quarterback, is out and uh, found out tonight that uh, he may be uh, st struggling to start the basketball season. He may have to come in late. And uh, last week I talked with Nolan Grove from South who suffered a broken leg. He's probably going to have the basketball season too. But let's talk a little bit about tonight. East is really struggling. They come in 1-5. Uh, their own foreign conference and lost their last five games. Also, the last three games, they haven't scored a point. Yeah, that's, that's really tough for, for a team. A conference is tough. Uh, North, I'm sure, tonight is going to uh, try to execute their game plan and, and uh, put, put it to Green Bay East early. One of the things that North has done real well this year is to score a lot of touchdowns. East, on the other hand, is averaging per game 6.3 points per game. They're going to. Yeah, that, that's really tough. Uh, I think North uh, probably tonight is going to rely on that rushing game again. Uh, there's, there's no question that they're, they're above average in, in terms of that. Uh, when, I, when you asked me to do this game, my, I remember my high school uh, English teacher, Fern Salisbury, told me to do my homework, so I did. And I looked up North's uh, record in the, in the WISP preps, and in six games they've rushed 170 times for 1,825 yards. That's 10.7 yards per carry. Uh, I think that's pretty good. That's real good. We're going to step out. When we come back, we'll have the national anthem and the kickoff for tonight's football game. I don't remember how it started. Go to that. Oh Our back and forth. It always came back. You probably don't remember what you told me. That was perfect. But I heard every word. The power of the knock is food. Your stew's delicious. I'm 88 years old, and I was with the ice capades when I was young. Now, being as old as I am, I lose balance. I don't like ending up this way, but what am I going to do? I got Meals on Wheels for the five years that I've been here. It's nice to know they come, and if you feel like talking, you can talk to them. I could talk for forever. They're totally a blessing.
helping us out the uh, programs that we were given at the gate Joe have the 2022 Green Bay East information <laughs> rosters and uh, uh, Logan went through um, most of the players and uh, helped us out with that Sheboygan North will be receiving the kickoff back to return is uh, Max Olson and uh, Vince Nineis Well, if statistics are accurate, uh, they should get good, pretty good field position because both players have uh, pretty decent uh, return averages for this season. Doing the kicking for uh, East is Brady Anderson. Nine Ice uh, picks it up at the 15, out to the 20, 25, 30, and Knocked out of bounds near the 40 yard line. Great return. 40 is a pretty good place to start. Taken out of bounds by Daniel Beaches. Starting offensive line for Sheboygan North at left guard is Evan Nickerson. At center, Owen Ailes. At right guard, Caleb Stahl. Left tackle is Elijah Gonzalez, and right tackle is Trenton Debink. We'll give a shout out to those guys. Burr is at quarterback. In motion is nine nice. Inside hand off to Hernandez. Uh, not much there. No gain on the play. North runs a triple option. Here's some uh, information, Joel, if you want to use that. Hernandez, the fullback, the wide outs, left and right. And Burr fakes the handoff, slips through the defense and gets all the way outside and into territory, uh, East Territory across the 50 yard line. Looks like that should be a first down. It's gonna Broke be a, a gain of, of 11. You know, it looked like at first, there you see him slipping through the defense. It looked like he was gonna get a hit at the line of scrimmage. Well, North's offensive line looks like it's outweighing uh, East by quite a bit. East has had trouble stopping the run. They've been uh, very susceptible in that department. They've given up over 1,200 yards. Burr keeps it, gets a great block from his wideout and is knocked out of bounds inside the 30-yard line. Throwing that key block was Preston Peterson. Look at that block by Peterson, number 11. 
That's what you need on, on that uh, quarterback keeper. You got to get that uh, defensive back or linebacker knocked out of it. Naina is the uh, wing on the left side. He goes in motion, pitch out. Oh, great penetration. And making the stop for East was Roland Allen. It's gotta be one of the few times when he's been stopped for a loss. Yeah, exactly. And it was a big loss, two losses, yeah. six. There goes the rushing average, Joel, <laughs> from 19 to 18 per carry. Yeah. Uh, Burr keeps it and is able to get it up near the 30-yard line. That was Olsen. That is Olsen on the carry. They got, uh, what, third and 12? Yeah. I'm getting it. That was all the carries have been by Max Olson. Number 12. There's a handoff. Nine Ice breaks through, slips by one tackler and is dragged down inside the five yard line. Another well blocked, well designed play. And that's a greatest first All carried by HD Ice, taken down by Rowan Allen. First down, the Raiders. First down, Sheboygan North uh, at the four yard line. Max Olson uh, has been starting at quarterback. Him and uh, Blake Burr will uh, rotate. Yeah, rotate depending on the formation. Uh, Max still in there, number 12. Olson uh, keeps it and is knocked down at the five. It's a loss of a yard. Max Olson carried the ball. He's got right good penetration on that play and uh, took away the pitch. It's going to be second down and goal. Ball at the uh, five yard line. Alex Hernandez, the deep back. Give it off to Hernandez. He's hit pretty hard. And he just scored. Okay. Touchdown, Sheboygan North. Looked like he was going to get stopped. Yeah, Devontae he broke a Brooks. tackle right up there, just for about the two or three yard line. Five yard pickup by Hernandez, and Sheboygan North has scored with uh, 8 14 remaining. Quite a drive, Joel. Again, all on the ground. The kick is up and good by Brody Conrad, a freshman. Looks like he's got a pretty good leg, too. Joe, we had mentioned in the opening that uh, East is averaging 6.3 points per game. Not looking good. <laughs> That's right. North has uh, pretty good defense against the Raj, too. They're holding their opponents to uh, 100 yards a game. And with them running for 300, the 3 to 1 ratio is a pretty good. Uh, yeah. It's. Uh, and uh, in talking with uh, coach upstairs, getting the uh, roster squared away, he said uh, it's been a tough year for the kids, too.
Nice to see the North players wearing pink for right. Breast Cancer yes, Awareness Month. Um, very familiar with that. Yeah. <laughs> Blake Burr is going to do the kicking. Uh, Blake is a fine defensive player. He plays on the uh, end or outside linebacker. Line drive kick carries down to about the eight yard line. Bouncing it to the outside, getting good yardage all yeah. the way out near the 40 yard oh, line. Got a penalty. It's Caden Fenton. Very, very late play. That return was actually by uh, Talon Lauderdum. They're taking it back. Uh, That's a tough break for uh, East. A holding pin. Yeah, holding. Ball is taken all the way back inside the 25-yard yard line. Yeah, yeah, when you're struggling, it's not good to start that deep. Yeah. North plays pretty good defense. Uh, Nine Eyes, who hasn't carried the ball a lot in that first uh, possession, is a is an outstanding defender. Keep an eye on him and uh, making penetration, uh, but the running back able to slip a tackle away for and gain five. some yards. No gain on the play, which actually is pretty good because he oh, could have had a, a three or a four yard loss. Yeah. Two wide receivers out here to the right, one to the left. Oh, now we got uh, giving them sirens. I thought he got past the yeah. line of scrimmage. Pretty good uh, gain on that play. Second down and five. Trying to bounce Ooh. it to the outside, but uh, good well defense. Well defended. Yeah, Burr forced the play inside, and uh, he got a little bit of help from his mates, and uh, not much of a gain. Okay, my Brent Craw, their uh, starter at South, is uh, out, was injured. DJ Broadnox is the uh, quarterback tonight. Low snap. Ooh, ball fumble. is punched through and a uh, little scramble for the ball. Looks, Looks like Sheboygan North has it. Making the recovery was uh, Ben Basler. The entire defensive line for North got good penetration and just collapsed right on the quarterback. Be first and ten for North. They're at the uh, 21 yard line of East, and uh, now we've got Burr as quarterback, and uh, number 12 Olson is uh, a wing on the left side, Nine Ice on the right wing, and Hernandez the deep back. Inside handoff to Hernandez. Good blocking by uh, North. Alex Hernandez carried the ball. Five yard Tackle game. By George he carried the ball that time. I thought it was Hernandez. Yeah, that's right, it was. It was. Here we go. Pitch out. And Olsen is taken down just outside the 10-yard line. 
Oh, that's nine high nine assists. Nine eyes. Yeah. Okay. Switch my numbers from uh, 12 <laughs> to 21. 12 and 21. Yeah. Hey, could have happened. Yeah. <laughs> They're spotting the ball actually on the 10, so it's going to be first and goal from the 10 yard line. Inside handoff to Hernandez, and he's into the end zone for a touchdown. Okay, touchdown. That inside handoff is really working well. I think East is worried about uh, nine eyes around the end. Hernandez with uh, four carries for 20 yards and uh, two touchdowns. North is good. <laughs> Extra point is through. Well, North is a fast starting team. They've, up until tonight, they had 91 points in the first quarter. Tonight with 14 more. That's just about their average. When you look at the uh, scoring by quarters, uh, East is allowed 91. North scored 90. Yeah, so it's in the first quarter. First quarter. That's the first half. Oh. They scored 169 points in the first half, North has. Yeah. And they're yeah. right up there in, in the uh, northeastern part of the state with 227 points. They, uh, they tend not to score so much in the second half because they've had a, a number of blowouts and uh, coach gets the uh, reserves in. And allows well, that, that's good. It, it gets those kids playing and, and working for, you know, more time on the field. Yeah. Get them more ready power for next year, them. too. Yeah. Or if they have to come in with an injury. Ooh. Kick is uh, not snap very hook. far, but uh, picked up at the 21. And the ball carrier is knocked out at about the 25. Woods on the return. Buki Woods is number one. A lot of wide receivers for East. Slow snap, good handle by the uh, quarterback. And uh, making the stop was uh, Olsen along with Burr. Making the catch, number 88, Jordan Cooper. Still a short game, just a couple of yards. Yeah, two yarder. From our vantage point, it almost looked like it was a backward lateral. <laughs> Didn't come out real clean. No, definitely, definitely not. Devontae Brooks, quarterback. Watch out going wide. There's a flag on the play. And the uh, ball carrier is hit for a loss. Good defense again. Holding on East. See if you think North would take this. They are. With the defensive playing, uh, they should push it back as far as they can. Better field position if they have to punt. Second penalty on East.
Snap is a good one that time. Another quick out. Looking for room and another, another penalty. penalty. That's got to be a hole. Caden Fenland on the reception. North had that one pretty well defensed. Yeah, East is uh, definitely that, going backwards. Oh, face mask. Face mask on North. Oh. I don't thought I thought thought we didn't commit any penalties. <laughs> It was a five yard or so it's still third and 15, 16. Sometimes those face mask penalties can be an automatic first time. Yeah. On the defensive line for North is Jet Benninghaus, number 45. Ben Basler, we mentioned his name, 46. Andrew Ruiz, Kingston Stewart. Stewart was uh, right up there in tackles for the team. Deep pass on an out pattern, out, but uh, yeah. incomplete. It's going to be third down and about uh, 17. And got it 18 up on the board. And that's the timeout Green Bay East. With the timeout, we'll take a short break and be right back. I'm out for Online. It feels good to have our views echoed back to us, but it's important to challenge our biases and break out of our bubble. Be sure you're getting some hard news in your media diet. And double check what you see on social media with a variety of credible news sources. Be informed, not misled. North's game last week, Joel, uh, they only attempted three passes uh, through all of them, completed a 73-yarder to uh, Preston that's a, Peterson. That's a pretty good per pass. Yeah, average. wonder what his rating would be. <laughs> I never could figure out a quarterback rating. Yeah, me either. <laughs> a 158.3, I think, is Jacob Stahl, number 19, is uh, one of the DBs back there. Along with uh, Olsen, number 12, Nine Ice in the middle. Quick out. Oh, Fenland slips one tackler. Still got gonna some be extracurricular yards. activities <laughs> after the pass was complete. Oh, this should give North pretty good field position. If I recall, they were not very good at punting. And North is very good at punt returns. Vince Nienheis has averaged 25 <laughs> yards, <coughs> excuse me, 25 yards per uh, return. And uh, I think he's back. He should be number uh, also back there, I think is Olsen, number 12. And kick is away. And Bounce is going to take a north bounce. No, no, yeah. now an east bounce. And uh, get away from the ball. North will have it on the 43. 43. Pretty good field position. Yeah. The punt was about 30 yards or so. That's pretty good. They were kicking away from nine highs for sure. That's pretty good strategy. <laughs> so on one, one side of my sheet, Joe, I got all the rushing. Mm-hmm. And on the other side is all the passing. <laughs> I won't need that side very I don't much. think so. Not tonight. Burr in at quarterback. Fernandez the deep back. Inside handoff. Uh-oh, fumble. Fumble, and it's taken away from Hernandez, and East has it. Fernandez went into the line. Must have had it stripped away, and we get a flag late. 
Going to see if we can check it out on a replay. Fernandez has it. Then yeah, all it does of a sudden get he stripped. drops it. Yeah. Or, yeah, had it taken away. Nine highs chased him down, but... Uh, Josh uh, Pittman on the long return. It was a penalty. Another face mask against North. Oh, boy. East is going to have it first down. At the down. four. First and goal at the four. Four-yard line. What of a turn of a what a, yeah. a turn of events. Holy cow. You don't see that very often. Get it stripped away like no, that. No, North was had the momentum all in its favor. Like oh good tackle. Good, yeah, good penetration. Good penetration by North and the stop is made at about the five yard line. Mm-hmm. Give him no gain. Ball is uh, spotted right at the uh, line of scrimmage. The original line of scrimmage. I think Second that was down. number 80, Kingston Stewart. Who Stewart made is uh, making a lot of tackles this year. Another handoff. Barreling through to the end zone, but uh, and he's in. Oh, they give him the touchdown. Green okay. Bay East. That should fire north up out of yeah, East on the board. There's our referee for tonight. We didn't uh, get the name of the officials. East is uh, gonna go for two. Over the middle, pass no is good. incomplete. Pass was intended for uh, Devontae Brooks. With uh, 2.58 left in the first quarter, North 14, East 6. Because of COVID-19, Students are more than half a grade level behind in math skills, and your kid might be one of them. Start the conversation before it's too late. Because when parents are part of the equation, kids do better in math. For tools and resources to get your child on track with math, visit BePartOfTheEquation.org. Back at North High School, in a surprising turn of events, uh, Fernandez had the ball stripped from him and uh, was returned all the way down to the, around Four. the 10-yard line, and then uh, face mask yeah. penalty. Uh, his final result was uh, East had it first and goal on the four, and they wound up scoring. Let's see how North answers this. Line drive kick is picked up at the 25. A lot of speed breaking through. Getting it way into East Territory and being knocked down at about the 20-yard line. Is that Nine Ice or Peterson? It was taken by one of the up men. I think yeah. it was Peterson on the long return. That was a pretty good answer to uh, the touchdown. Yeah, exactly. Replay that one, Scott. <laughs> <laughs> Olsen coming in as the quarterback. North has run it 12 times, not passed it. Nine ice in motion. Pitch back to Nainais, picks up good yardage, gets it down 
near the, I think, inside the 15-yard line. About the 12, it looks like. 13. We'll give him a gain of seven. Average way down. <laughs> Set yeah, it's kind of hard to maintain 19.4 yards a carry. Exactly. Olson takes the snap, reverse, and good defense, good defense that time yeah. by East. East defenders held their positions really well there. You get who the ball carrier was? I did not, no. We'll give it the nine ice. <laughs> it's going to be third and one. Olson. Barking out the signals. Nine nice in motion. Stops. Hand off. No, Olson Olsen keeps it. Keeper. He's going to walk into the Touchdown. end zone. Wow. Very good decision making there. <laughs> yeah. That was for sure. Yeah. That triple option really puts pressure on the defense. Well, that was a good answer. That was an excellent answer. You're right. <laughs> Olsen with uh, 55 yards so far. We're not out of the first quarter yet. Ooh, no good. No good. Uh, the kicker, the freshman kid, had seven in a row last week. Mm -hmm. I don't know if that one was partially blocked or what. It just didn't clear the uh, line of scrimmage very well. Twenty to six, Sheboygan North. Still a minute twenty-two left in the first quarter. Yeah, it's been a long quarter. Surprising because everybody's keeping the ball on the ground. Exactly, you're right. Caden Fenlin uh, back deep. Along with uh, Bucci Woods, number one. He's showing a little spirit out there, though, especially on that uh, long return. It's a defense that's uh, holding them back. Woods takes it at the 10. Trying to slip by a Ooh. couple of tacklers and he gets it out over the 30 yard line. So we got an injured player there for North. Yeah, we got two of them down. Of them down. Yeah. Uh, getting up and being able to walk off is Oscar Hernandez. And uh, I think that second player got up and is running off now Noah Blaha now North's defense has got to respond Trevor Tegel helped me with uh, some of the starters and uh, who they are and uh, after we get done with the offensive line, he says, hey, we got to mention the defensive line. <laughs> he gave me a bunch of kids that'd be out there. Yeah. Hernandez, who looked like he got hurt, is back there. He's playing the uh, left corner position, number one. Quick pass Oops, and uh, down. sliding down Another is DJ Broadnox. They're not getting much from their passing game. No. <laughs> Green Bay East holding. Oh boy. 10 yards back to the 26. They've, uh, I've got them now with uh, three penalties, but I think it's more than that. 
the point is <laughs> they have a tough time with offense the way it is. Uh, you, oh, penalties are tough to overcome, especially when you're struggling on offense. That's pretty obvious. <laughs> Deep down the middle oh. and uh, pass is incomplete. Good pass defense play yeah. by Sheboygan Norse. There was some contact there, but it was pretty incidental, I think. Well, he got in front of the kid and uh, did a good job. Actually, the North defender had a better position in the ball. He's three for six on passing. Still a minute four left in the first quarter. It's the quarter that won't end. <laughs> Second down, out pattern is uh, over the head. Overthrown. Yeah, that uh, receiver out there was Isaiah Lyons. Passes were well defended by Oscar Hernandez. It wasn't going anywhere even if it was complete. It's third down and uh, 19. It's interesting how one uh, offense only does running, basically, <laughs> and the other team has been uh, almost all passing. Well, when you're down 26 in the first quarter, you kind of got to go Yeah, to the right, air. exactly. He's uh, passing attempt. They're, uh, they were 12 for 31 coming in. Not a very good percentage. Another deep pass. Oh, Receiver's wide open. wide open. He's got it. What a play. Mm, good catch. Nine Eyes caught him, but uh, making that catch was Bucci Woods. I don't know if got caught looking in the backfield, but he was wide open. Yeah, about a 45 yard pass. Bucci got behind the defense, and uh, he's a fast runner. Yeah, quick. But uh, Nine Eyes, thank goodness, was uh, fast enough to catch him. First and 10, ball spotted on the 28-yard uh, line. A pitch out, foul oh, ball is lost, fumble. and North is going to get it. Not being able to handle the ball was uh, Matusa Vespari. Pitch was a little bit behind him. Yeah. Another turnover. That matches uh, Norse number of turnovers, each team with uh, one. East has two, I believe. East has two, two fumbles. Yeah, that's yeah. what I thought. Still 33 seconds left. Yeah. Ball spotted on the 36 yard line of Sheboygan North. Burr on the flip out to Hernandez, he's got some running room and gets it out over the 45, near the 50. Yeah, 13 yards. Good play, good reading of the defense that time. He held the ball long enough to make the defender commit and then pitched it back. That's what I was talking about. Thank you. <laughs> First and 10 north. Ball spotted on the 48-yard uh, line, and I don't think we'll get another playoff. Maybe. North hustled up to the line. Yeah. Peterson, the wide out on the left. Ball is snapped, and uh, Hernandez takes it up the middle yeah. into East Territory at about the 48. Give him a gain of four. And uh, that's... That should do it. Finally. <laughs> end of the first quarter. Scott... You can run some commercials. How are you doing? Hey, Mason. Hey, Mason. Thank you. A place to make my own. Place that I call home. 
place that I call home. I'm Belinda, and this is Willard, and we were adopted in 2021. When we first met Todd, he was singing a song, and I was like, wow, look at this kid with the biggest smile, <laughs> and he has a big heart to match. The energy you give Todd, you get it back from Todd. Yes. Todd's a joy. Yes, Todd's is. really is a great joy. I love him. <laughs> you and you. <laughs> Learn about adopting a teen from foster care. You can't imagine the reward. Visit AdoptUSKids.org. Jason, let's go see your room. When you're behind the wheel, always watch for people walking and biking. It's Wisconsin law to give bikes at least three feet when passing. In Wisconsin, the laws are the same for bicyclists and motorists. So if you bike, ride with the traffic and obey stop signs and lights. People ride bicycles to go places, get exercise, reduce pollution, save money, and have fun. Watch for people riding bikes when you're driving. Share and be aware. Oh, well, getting ready for the snap Fumble. gets away from Burn. He uh, lost it, I believe. East has it. Maybe not. They haven't signaled yet. They get a I'm loss of eight. Yeah, Burr got it back. Joe, we uh, talked earlier about the scoring that North does in the first half. 169 points. He had 20 in that first quarter. Uh, we figured it out. How many <laughs> points per fir per first half has North scored? What was it? Twenty-eight point six. Close enough. Twenty-eight point one six. But uh, good first quarter. Yeah. See if they can clean it up. It's going to be uh, got it fourth down. Burr. He's wanted the pass. Room. Now he's oh, going to take room. off with it. He's going to have a first down yeah. and then some. Mm -hmm. Knocked out of bounds right at about the 35-yard line. Good play by... He didn't have uh, anybody open and pulled it down, and it was wide open for their sideline. And good play by Blake. Down to the uh, 32. Looks like, yeah, 32. So it was about a 20-yard gain or so. In motion, taking the pitch is uh, Olsen looking. Good blocking on the end. Yeah, good blocking and a good cut. Oscar Hernandez throwing that block on the wing. Olsen... Uh, with a fine gain, gets gain the first of down. 10, first down, yeah. gain of 11, down to the 21. 66 yards in six carries for Max. Good That's basketball player too. He's had at 11-3. Uh, reverse, oh, oh nine nice, nice with a big <laughs> opening, takes <laughs> it in for a score, 21 yard run. Uh oh, penalty. It's after the touchdown, so I don't know if it's a celebration. He's got that average back up there, yeah. Joel. <laughs> See, what, See the what the call is on the yeah. field. Our officials are conferring around the five-yard line. One thing when North you're is coming back, so it must be against North. One thing about... Uh, the offense at North runs, if your defense isn't very disciplined, you're gonna get uh, yeah. big plays against you. You gotta be real disciplined on defense. That's Let's what see what the call on is. The, on, on the quarterback. Uh, Unsportsmanlike conduct on, on East. Oh. Still a touchdown. <laughs> Play stands. I didn't see what. I didn't see what happened either. The penalty. 
but it came out right away, like right you at, said. Right as he scored, yeah. The crew tonight, we have uh, Richard Bartson and Greg Zablocki on camera, Eric Wiesman, graphics, and uh, head of the band is uh, Scott Mayloff, alongside Joe Gulig, I'm Mike Martin. Told you it'd be easy, Joe. <laughs> That kick is right through. No, nothing's easy at my age. With 9.48 remaining, north, 27, east, 6. Because of COVID-19, students are more than half a grade level behind in math skills. And your kid might be one of them. Start the conversation before it's too late. Because when parents are part of the equation, kids do better in math. For tools and resources to get your child on track with math, visit BePartOfTheEquation.org. Back at North High School, and uh, they're accepting the penalty, Joe, on, uh, for the kickoff. So North will be kicking off from the East 45. This should pin him very deep. I've got East for four penalties for uh, 45 yards. Unofficial. We got old Vic up here in the booth, Joe. Into the and, end uh, zone. Burr's kick is uh, through the end zone. Were you part of that team when you were in high school that went to South and uh, rescued old Vic? <laughs> I plead the fifth. <laughs> it's an interesting story, one it we is. can't tell on TV, <laughs> but uh, they had, uh, I think it was the Latin banquet was held at yes, South that yes. year. And uh, so old Vic and Big Red were at the banquet and Vic never made it back to North through the course of the summer and during the football season, we had to go out and rescue him. Uh, oh, the bigger he's in you. <laughs> East uh, starting from the 20 yard line. They'll be starting from the 15. That looked like a false start. Yep, false start. Go get him, old Vic. <laughs> Quite a costume. Yeah, it is. It's got to be hard walking down those <laughs> steps. <laughs> One of the hardest things with those uh, costumes on is being able to see very yeah. well. All right, first and 15 from the 15. Hand off inside. No game. Or short Not game. much going there. Did you get the number of that running back? Number seven, I think. Devontae Brooks. Again, North's defensive line is just plugging every hole. Uh, Pursuit is excellent, excellent. You know, once you get into playoffs and you're playing the upper echelon teams, it's your defense, in That's my right. opinion, that wins the games. Well, and North's offense has been able to keep the defense off the field for the most part, and that keeps them fresh. Perrion Palmer is the uh, cornerback right in front of us. Low snap, good pass, yeah, and knocked out game. of bounds. Buki Woods on the catch. Gain of a yard, so it's third and eight. Second catch by Woods. Again, North stops in here. They'll get good field position again. I'm not sure about this because this uh, roster we have is old, but uh, 
Number 10 on here is DJ Broadnox. Third and eight. Good snap. Pass is uh, complete, but, but short. The first down. Yeah. Good defense. Pickup of about three yards on the yeah. play. Gonna be fourth and three, fourth and four. Blake oh, Burr and making the stop. Fourth and five. Olsen and Nine Ice are uh, deep to return the punt. Devante Brooks back to punt. Should get the ball over somewhere on midfield. Another pick. I think that's going to be on North jumping offside. I don't know if it's going to give them enough for a first it, down. Yeah, it wouldn't be enough for a first down, but might be close Ooh, enough that he sends the point. offense yeah. back out there. <laughs> it was a good play by the East punter. He clapped his hands for the snap, saw one of the players jump a little bit, and then when he clapped well, it again. A first down. So it is a first down for East. It is a first down, all yeah. right. Well, referees are gone wrong again, Joe. <laughs> well, they didn't move the chains right away, so I thought, well, maybe they were short. First and 10, East, ball spotted on the 31. Overthrown pass. Pass is incomplete. Pass is incomplete. Keep in mind that all the stats that I spew out are unofficial. <laughs> uh, I've got uh, East completing six out of 11 passes, which uh, coming in, they were uh, only completing 38%. Yeah. But their pass, with the exception of that one, haven't produced very much. Good rush oh, up front, but again, the ball is behind the intended up. receiver. Third down. Was an interesting uh, wizard meeting this morning. <laughs> you see, Conversation I, was very lively. I got my wizard pin on. I gave mine away. <laughs> As a souvenir. You should get a hat like uh, Ron Ronnie. has, the wizard hat. Those are expensive. The pin, pins were only a buck or something like that. All right, three wide receivers off That's to the right left. Again. Good snap. Going the other way, pass is incomplete. incomplete. Good defense. Receiver had it for a second. I think Nine Heist jumped in there and broke it up. He's a, he's a hitter. Yeah. East with uh, fourth and ten is going to punt again or attempt, attempt to. Hopefully, North won't jump that outside. That was actually number fifty-eight who broke up that pass. Terrell, Terrell Yang. Yang. Yeah. He's also ranks among the top tacklers on the team. Well defended. Blake Burr leads the team with 29 tackles. Nine is 27. Kingston Stewart, we mentioned his name a little earlier, 23. Line drive Ball kick. is taken Nine at the 44. Nine Ice around the corner, picks up a block. That's Olsen. Olsen, Olsen is knocked out of bounds near the 20 yard line. Great block by Nine Ice to uh, get Max a few more yards. Their numbers are too close together for my eyes. Well, <laughs> then I don't feel so bad. Hey, that two and one can two get and one mixed and one up. And two. <laughs> Dyslexia. Yeah. Eight nineteen left in the first half. Ball is uh, spotted yeah. right on the twenty yard line. Olsen is in the slot on the left. Nine Ice is a wing on the right. 
Burr back looking. Has a wide receiver wide oh, open, but a great tackle out there. Making the catch was uh, Preston Peterson. They're calling it an Olsen on the catch. Olsen. Just a gain every yard. Second and nine. That might be the only time this game we see North pass on first down. <laughs> that was a kind of surprise to me too. It's a good design, but a great tackle. Inside handoff to Hernandez. Nice. He's dragging the pile inside the 25. Well, he runs hard, real, real hard inside. And he's not that big, it doesn't look like. No. Stocky. <laughs> Strong. Strong legs, yeah. Alex is a senior, goes 5'7", 180. Third and four. It faked the Hernandez pitch out to Olsen. He's going to... Now he does get by both tacklers. He's into the end zone. Touchdown. That was a combination of a good move and a poor tackle with Tim. Wow, that was exciting. Mm -hmm. It's about a 16-yard run. Well, this is about where North is on the average for the year. That's uh, Max's second touchdown of the game. Good snap. Kick is uh, up and no good. No good. Just a little wide left. Nope. A lot of whistles on the field. Let's see what's happening. Somebody Injured is down player. for north. Can't quite catch the number on that uh, kid. Forty-five, it looks like, and he's in pain. Yeah, that's uh, Jet Benninghaus, one of their uh, top defenders. They're working on his uh, right leg. Looks like Hope a cramp. Yeah, hopefully yeah. that's all that's it all is. That's all it is. Yeah. <laughs> a cramp can be painful. Did you ever get those when you're sleeping? Oh. <laughs> 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 yeah. Well, Benning House is up, and he's going to he's going to walk it off, walk off under his own power. Benning House is a senior, 6'3", 255. It's kind of nifty how we can hear some of the uh, talking from the field. <laughs> Are we supposed to? Uh, as long as they don't uh, get naughty, we're fine. Unfortunately for Green Bay East, they're in uh, familiar territory. The only I shouldn't say the only, but one positive for night for East is uh, they have scored. Coming into tonight's game, they were shut out three games mm -hmm. in a row. Ball is taken at the uh, 23, trying to get the corner and uh, runs out of bounds. Is uh, five. Talon Lauderdum. Six forty nine left in the second quarter. According to my uh, stats, East has run the ball five times and thrown it thirteen. It sure seems like they had the ball for more plays than that. Yeah, right. Well, I think North is going to expect that they're going to be throwing the ball now. I got timeout. 
Uh, East looked East. like they were uh, confused on uh, who was playing what positions. Uh, next game for these uh, two teams, North will uh, host Oshkosh North next Friday, a 7 o'clock game. Green Bay East is going to host Manitowoc Lincoln uh, also on Friday at 7 o'clock. WSCS TV will be at uh, KLC when they uh, host the Chilton Tigers. Joe, that's my old school. I taught at Chilton for 13 years. Well, when I was at the press and worked in sports, my assignment was in the Eastern Wisconsin Conference and the Central Lakeshore. Would so that I have been around 86, 1986? Late 80s. Dwight okay. retired in 84, and I went over to sports right after that. Because in uh, 86, North, Oosburg, and Chilton won the state basketball championships. Rick Brunigy in the house, along yeah, with I, Glenn Hilpert Souser. I covered Oosburg that year, and... and uh, oh, a oh, sack is a made. Sack. Did, Denny Moore decided to cover all three games in Madison, so I had to sit home. <laughs> Stewart on the sack. Loss of about eight on the play. It's going to be uh, second down and uh, 18. Like, yeah. That's the first sack for the horses. This game, Tonight, yeah. yeah. I don't know if they call that one fumble a sack or not. Yeah, I don't, yeah. Yeah, I don't know either. It could have been. I was, trying to, I was looking at the stats to see if they had anything about sacks, but it doesn't look like it. And another flag. Ooh, this is... You know, if it's, get, if it's getting old for us, Joe, it's got to be getting old for them, too. Oh, boy. So, going to be second down and 23. Ball spotted on the 18-yard line. Deep pass. Deep pass. Good pass defense oh, good and defense. knocked away. Knocking that ball away was Max, Max Olsen. Olsen. Just trying to see if we can get a North End or a score on that uh, uh, Oshkosh North game. Isn't that North's next opponent? Yes, it is. Yeah. The wonders of the internet. Third down and long. Broadnox uh, showed a good arm on that last pass, Chris. Ah, Chris. <laughs> Joe. <laughs> you can call me. Spreading out wide is uh, Brooks. Quarterback oh, is going to get oh. sacked again, but I think we're going to have a face mask on North. Yeah. Looked like the quarterback almost turned into that face mask. Yeah. Flags came from all over. <laughs> I would call that an obvious penalty. Referee uh, is going to come over and give us the call, I think. Yeah. Fifteen. Greg Zablocki's mic picking up that call from the official. Second face mask on North tonight. Still third down and uh, sixteen to make it fifteen. Two wide receivers left and right. And a whistle and another penalty. This is why the games take so long, John. Stops the clock, stops momentum. 
Well, start on the offense. Another penalty by East. Now it's third and 20. Now they got the clock running again. Five minutes left in the first half. I think uh, Scott and the guys, Greg and uh, Richard, will be uh, doing the halftime half show. Nice to have the uh, pep band. Yeah. Ball spotted on the 21. Third down and 20. Deep down the middle, the pass oh, is oh. just over the outstretched arms. Uh, Devante Brooks. I just look up on Max Preps and Green Bay West and Oshkosh North are 0 0 in the second period. Mm. Interesting score. Yeah. West is uh, better than they've been. They, they struggled for a while. Mm -hmm. And uh, another oh. penalty. Offside. Look like one of the gunners took off quick. <laughs> you know what? I think it was the gunner on the left and the gunner oh, on the right. <laughs> well, the return men for North are on the east. 40. Yeah, jeez. The snaps back to the center, or to the kicker, have not another been very one. crisp. <laughs> and another penalty. This is a track meet. He'd be disqualified. Yeah. <laughs> Referee's going to get his steps in. Okay, here's the call. Yeah. False start. I got that as the ninth penalty of the first half on East. Not a very uh -oh. good, and it's blocked. Partially blocked. Yeah, yeah. picked up by Nine Ice on the 30. Cuts it back. He could go into the end zone. Touchdown. That was strange. It looked like they had him pinned to the sideline, and he made it a cut to his left. Zoom right through the hole. Somebody hand out an Emmy to what a play. Yeah. <laughs> oh, nice. His quickness is uh, quite impressive. Yeah, it's off the charts. Yeah. Scott, if you can, cue that uh, punt return again for us uh, after the extra point. Uh -oh. They're going to change footballs. I think that one ball is worn out from being <laughs> passed over the uh, goal line. Brody, Brody. Kicking the extra point is um, Brody. Where's where nope. your name? Brody. Somebody got a hand on no, that in, block. No good. See if we get the replay on that uh, partially blocked punt. Brody Conrad on that extra point. Doesn't look like we're going to get the replay. No. Uh, well, I'll tell you, folks, it was a good return. The other thing we know for sure, it was, it was for a touchdown. <laughs> 39 to 6. North had 20 first quarter points. They've got 19 second quarter points. East's lone score came after a 
long return of a football taken away from a running back. They scored on a four yard run. Burr, little chip Good shot track. taken at the 28. Trying to get around the corner, slipping by one tackler, slipping two. by two. Got the corner. And knocked out of bounds. Was the ball carrier Josiah John. Next to the uh, fumble that East returned to the five yard line. This will be their best starting position on the north 41, 46 yard line. There's a penalty on North on that play. I don't know if it was a late hit or what. Good arm on the official. It's going to be uh, first and ten North on, the, or pardon me, east. for East on the North. 47 yard line. Brady Anderson. <laughs> Halftime score Oshkosh 42, Green Bay West 7. That was a big score, scoring quarter for Oshkosh. Yeah, all <laughs> right. <laughs> I, I guess I didn't refresh my screen. <laughs> yeah, Brooks, I guess. Brooks uh, was stopped. For uh, no gain. Not the first time I've been wrong. And it won't hey, be it'll the happen. Last. <laughs> it's nice of uh, Eric Wiesman yeah, to come up and uh, give us that information. He never miss an opportunity to make the announcers <laughs> look bad. <laughs> I think he was just trying to be nice and give us a score. Oh, more old Vic is coming back. Yeah. He doesn't look very happy. <laughs> old Vic. He's old. Quick out. Uh, good, good tackle made out there. I think that was Blake Burr. Anderson on the catch. Gain of about three yards. Going to be third down and eight or so. <laughs> Set up in the backfield is uh, Devante Brooks. Quick out and a oh, good hit. Good Looks like the ball was the caught. Yeah. Still going to be short of a first down about four yards. Third and four. Wind the clock. Third down. I'd say it's fourth down. Fourth down and about three. Long three. Yes. I said four. Yes. Long three. It sure seems to take East a long time to get a play organized and get up to the line. I would agree. Big time stop. Snap. Quarterback looking, looking. looking. Got him. North breaks through. And the quarterback has to throw the ball away. Yeah. Incomplete. So but it was the pressure. By Basler that uh, caused that play to blow up. Yeah, they got pre pretty good pressure there and uh, good coverage on the uh, defensive backs. North takes over on the 39 yard line. They've got a minute 44 remaining to uh, try and put more points on the board. Inside handoff, uh, Hernandez. 
Short gain. Yeah, pick up a and one. Arena. North is uh, going to have a boatload of rushing yards, Joe, in this first half. Well, they've been pretty consistent at that all year. Fake gives it to uh, Nine Eyes. He slips by a couple of tacklers before he's wrestled down at the 44. Slipped the first guy, but not the second. The clock is running under a minute. See if they uh, try to pass it. Nope. Burr read the defense well and uh, falls forward for a first down. Guess and we what? get penalties down the field. Um, to see if that's on north. They've been very aggressive with their blocking, Joe. I wonder if they're going to get called for a penalty. I don't know. I was focused on the ball carrier, and I just out of the corner of my eye saw the little skirmish over there. The refs are talking about it. See what the call is. And it's going against East. Penalty number 10. Wow. From the spot of the foul, puts it down to the 25 yard line. Second uh, unsportsmanlike conduct penalty on East yeah. this half. I think that's a little bit of frustration on their part. I oh, mean, big time. I know they have a lot of pride and they, they don't want to get pushed around. Ball spotted on the 25. Nine ice in motion, pitch, pitch out to him, going wide, cuts good it up, cut. got a good block. <laughs> Still on his feet, oh. fighting forward, gets it down and we have near goal. the 10 yard line. 18.2 seconds left. See what the penalty is here. Oh my. This has not been fun. Nope. But uh, it's always fun seeing Nine Eyes run. He's pretty nice. shifty. Still haven't indicated. The ball is, what, down on the... It's around the ten, five, I think. Ten, five yard line. Yeah, I think near the 10. Again, officials are... Well, they're going over to talk to uh, East. Nico Sila is the uh, head coach. He, he had the uh, like it's long hair. Back. Oh, that was declined. I yeah. thought he had the first down. I did too, but apparently not. It's going to be a uh, first down sideline. for East. Yeah. Ball spotted on the 11 yard line. You got 18 seconds. I don't know. They got a. <laughs> yeah. 89 yard play <laughs> in the book. Good snap. Deep, Deep pass. And intercepted. intercepted. Looks yeah. like nine ice. ice. Nope. Not by nine ice. That interception was made by Jacob Stahl. Very good defense again. Had the uh, receiver covered. Ball was just a little underthrown. For uh, North, that's their uh, third interception of the year. And they have it with uh, 8.6 seconds left. Bet it's a run. Nope, Ball fumbled. is fumbled. 
Burr picks it up, but then he's wrestled down right around the 40 yard line. And that'll do it for the first half. And that'll be the end of the first half. North on top, big, 39 to six. Don't uh, go too far, because uh, we'll have some halftime entertainment for you, and uh, just prior to the start of the second half, we'll have some halftime stats. How are you doing? Hey, Mason. Hey, Mason. Thank you. A place to make my own. A place that I call home. This place that I call home. I'm Belinda, and this is Willard, and we were adopted in 2021. When we first met Todd, he was singing a song, and I was like, wow, look at this kid with the biggest smile. <laughs> and he has a big heart to match. The energy you give Todd, you get it back from Todd. Yeah. Todd's a joy. Yes, Todd's really is a great joy. I love him. <laughs> you and you. <laughs> Learn about adopting a teen from foster care. You can't imagine the reward. Visit adoptuskids.org. We hope everyone has a safe and fun homecoming. Dancers, your music is on.
set on the field tonight by senior club neighbor Slim Uncle, by a new neighbor in Philip Kukula, and Madison Gilmore. The music and movement for tonight's field show were selected and designed by senior drum major Madison Gilmore. Originally released in 2012 as the title track to indie rock group Fun's second album, this chart builds on Queen-inspired harmonies as they explore the concept of finding one's place in a chaotic and changing world. This is Some Nights.
brings together inspiring great melodies into a driving and dynamic piece that captures the essence of chasing one's dreams and overcoming obstacles as we journey through life. This is Counting Stars. support as these students have grown and developed has been priceless. All the late nights with concerts, pep band, trips, fundraisers, driving students to lessons, and many other commitments. We could not do this without the dedicated band parents. Senior band parents, please stand and be recognized. For our final selection tonight, we feature our graduated seniors as we turn to the music of Coldplay and their hit single, The Sky Full of Stars.
the band would like to invite everyone to hang around after the game and join them for their annual homecoming this quarter from one. Jason, let's go see your room. back at North High School getting ready to start the second half. There's a minute left on the clock before we uh, get rolling. We have some halftime stats. Uh, Green, Bay East, Green Bay East had a tough go of it. Uh, they rushed the ball seven times for only 10 yards. Uh, they were eight for 18 with one interception, 68 yards. Uh, for the half, only 78 yards, Joel. And really, their only touchdown came on that uh, long return long of a return fumble, of a fumble or, a takeaway. or a takeaway. So, I mean, North's defense has been pretty decent the, the whole game. Um, they've covered everything, stopped the, the run. All right, stats for North in uh, 27. Out of the 28 plays, Joel, 27, 27 were run. running plays. They uh, garnered 198 yards. That's a 7.3 average. Probably a little down from their uh, season average. They were one for one in passing. I mean, With give uh, credit one to yard, they had a 199 total yards in the first half. Give credit to East defense. They bottled up some of the running plays uh, quite well. We uh, talked at halftime, Joe and I did, uh, what the threshold was for a running clock uh, So we'll have to keep keep an eye out for that if uh, 33 points is enough. I'm not sure. I think it's might be 35 The thing about a running clock in football It keeps going <laughs> You don't I do no, I mean that it never you can never cut the lead down enough to stop, stop the, running, the clock. running clock It just it keeps up what are they? Stop for out of bounds. Uh, after a touchdown, yeah. some of that kind yeah. of stuff. Thank you. All right, All right. North, North is going to kick off. off. Yeah, Bunchy Brown, Brunchy Woods is back deep. He's going to get it. Takes it at the ten. Cuts it up the, uh, the side right sideline, line and uh, Olson knocks him out of bounds. But uh, good return. That's something North could uh, stand to work on there. You yeah. get pretty good blocking up front. And you'll see Olsen just get him out of bounds in time. First and 10 east. Ball is going to be placed right on the 40. It's not a running clock yet because it's yeah uh, right. Sorry about the uh, halftime technical difficulties with the sound. Run up the middle. Good run. Yeah, and That's I think it was Nine Ice got a hold of him, kept him from so uh, far. Yeah. Nothing fancy about it either. A gain of 50. Ball is at the 40. Yeah, 15 yard gain. They more than doubled their uh, production goal. in the game. He's uh, tightening up their offensive formation, too. Another handoff. And uh, offensive line doing a good job for East, pushing the pile. Five yards, six yards. Yeah, give him six yards. Get on the 
I don't think East is conceding here by running the ball. I think they're just trying to be I'm effective. I'm just wondering if they uh, think they can, uh, can run out muscle the North. Yeah. Certainly looks to be the case. They've uh, another tight formation. Yes, they've tightened up the formation and uh, got their uh, quarterback under center, which they didn't do the entire first half. Another hand up off the middle. Another first down. Good job by East, powering the ball. Well, good experience for North to have to tighten it up and, and uh, plug up the line. Yeah, they're gonna. They're gonna face some. Lot better teams, said, running uh, teams than uh, East has shown, but uh, hey, they're coming out spirited in the second half. North has got everybody within five yards. And off trying oh, to good, bounce it to the outside. And looks like the ball was fumbled. It was, and North recovers. Okay. On the carry that time was Isaiah Lyons. I didn't see who got the fumble. Let's see if we can get it on replay. <laughs> nope. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> What we do know is North has it back uh, at, at the 36, 36 or 37, seven. actually. I imagine North will stick to the ground. Olsen uh, lining up as the quarterback with Hernandez behind him. The wide out on our side is uh, Peterson. Nice, nice in motion. Olsen keeps it, takes it up the middle and uh, gets over the 40 yard line. Mm -hmm. Another so good run. Five yards on the play. Olsen in the first half had uh, 82 yards and seven carries. He was a uh, dynamite. Well, the ability to, you know, run three backs is, is quite, uh, puts a lot of pressure on the defense. Max also had two touchdowns. And off to Nainice, he cuts it right up the middle, trying to bounce it to the outside and then stays in the middle. The ball is fumbled, but I believe it was, I think it he was, was down prior yeah. to. Ball is gonna be spotted right on the 45 yard line. That was a gain of what? 15? About 18 yards. 18? Nine ice up to uh, 80 yards in the ball game. Fake to our Hernandez, pitch out to Nine ice. We get a flag. Another flag. Holy cow, there was a big mess out there. A lot today of flags. Is, today isn't flag day, is it? <laughs> Glenn Hilpertzelzer stopped up in the booth and said the same thing. Joe, that's not original material. I I asked Glenn if I could use Hey, you were going to do a shout-out. Don't forget that. Oh. <laughs> yeah, this would be a good time. i got to give a shout-out to my son-in-law, Brian Getch. He played quarterback at North in 1996-97, and I, I bet he could appreciate the running game that North has got tonight because they were... Uh, in a lot of close games at the, the time, but they only managed a couple of wins. But uh, first still. and twenty. I I think uh, I remember Getch uh, quarterbacking. That's right around the time yeah. I started announcing. Oh, here goes ball break. Oh, the runner yeah. breaks loose. Please. That was uh, Hernandez. Yes. Can't keep a good man down. No. Fifteen yard pickup. Make it sixteen. Alex now with uh, 54 yards. It's a three-headed monster on the running game. Keeps everybody fresh, everybody in the game. Nickerson, Ailes, Stahl, oh, pardon me, Gonzalez and Debink. That interior line for North. 
Pitch out, good fill. Good job by Peterson not to uh, pick up the... Uh, Crack back. Yeah. yeah, illegal block. See where Nine Eyes was pushed out. Pretty good defense that time by East. Contain uh, Nine Eyes' uh, carry. Got him at what, the 35? That's pretty close to a first down. Yeah. Got another, another penalty? I believe it was a uh, personal foul oh. face mask on North. North. Oh my. That puts them back about where they started. Second and 16. That's the third face mask penalty on North. Usually don't get him on offense. No, not right, not on offense. Third down and 16. Counter. Nice, nice counter, he right up the There's middle, he's gonna fast. get it. First down and another <laughs> face mask face penalty. penalty. That one was on. There was no attempt by the defense to not face not mask, that was intentional. He, he went right up high. So with nine guys to 20 on that. Yeah, 21 yard gain. Wow. 106 yard, 105 yard. Let me try that one more time. 106 yards for uh, nine ice on 11 but carries. I'm glad you're doing the stats. My experience with math is sketchy at best. All righty, still got Burr now in that quarterback. High snap, give it off to Hernandez. Hernandez. And a uh, pretty good tackle. Oh, hard in. But uh, picks up good yardage. The ball by Six. Yep. Six. Got the student body right in front of us. They're all standing. By the way, Joe, you mentioned about being able to sit. You do have a chair, but the problem is with the student body standing, you're not gonna see much. I'm, I'm so oh, short that- Illegal procedure, jumping off for North was Oscar Hernandez. North has gotta clean that out. You can't go up against strong teams and, and oh and yeah, I agree with you abilities. wholeheartedly. North, uh, a great first half, twenty first quarter points and nineteen second quarter points. He scored in the first quarter. Their uh, first score in. Uh, Three, four games. four games. Peterson wide to the left. In motion. And taking it in from about the five yard line was Nine Eyes. Too easy. Well, you get the defense moving one way on that. Nine Heist cuts back. Um, with, a, with a quick runner like that, it's real hard to defend. He is very shifty. Yep. And he runs straight up. He's... Defense comes through, but misses on the block. The kick is good. And now it's now it should be six. a clock. Life doesn't always give you time to change the outcome. Pre-diabetes does. One in three adults has pre-diabetes, but with early diagnosis, pre-diabetes can be reversed. And you can change the outcome. 
Take the one-minute pre-diabetes risk test today. Go to doihaveprediabetes.org. Back at North High School where uh, the Raiders have just scored again. It's uh, 46 to 6. You can see it there on your screen. Uh, first points of the second half for North. Expect to All see the result a lot of, of the, the turnover. Uh, yeah, right. Expect to see a lot of the reserves rest of the ball game. See how Coach O'Brien plays that. East defensive coordinator is uh, Jaswan Jis Witt. Uh, Logan Surprise, who helped us with uh, some information before the game. We'll give a shout out oh. to those two guys. Ball is picked up at the seven. And, and North uh, has right got them at the 15. Yeah, the didn't 10. even get to the 15 so yard got line. To the 10. Yeah. <laughs> Getting off the bottom of the pile, looks like that was uh, Joseph Yuckum, I think. Hard to read that number. Up nope, was number 12, Max Olson. Okay, a lot of numbers out there we haven't seen, Joe. Jackson Merrill, 64, is in the middle. Number 80 is Kingston Stewart. Those guys are starters. One of the kids, Brody Conrad, 34. Andrew Reese, is that 74? Yeah, 23 is uh, Cade Highfire. High tire, pardon me. Again, he's in tight. Quarterback, no, not the a handle. keeper. He's firing off the ball. Not well, much going the Brooks. Brooks on the carry. Pick up a four. Taken down by Andrew Ruiz. Short gain. I said four. I can wrote it down as three. Okay. <laughs> Also in there on defense is uh, Hudson O'Brien. Inside handoff. Ooh. Oh, ball, ball carrier smacked Damn. a couple times, but nobody wanted to wrap him up. up. <laughs> Brooks on the carry again. He picks up one. Okay. They had him stop for about a five yard loss and he just spun on him. Good call on that one. Nice replay, Scott. Replays have been uh, really nice, except on that punt return. <laughs> we'll, have to, we'll have to clean that up next <laughs> week. Actually, we got to clean it up for tomorrow's game. We're out at Lakeland for their homecoming game. You doing that one too? Yeah. South is home tonight, both uh, north and south at home. You don't see that very often. And maybe even more rare than that is they're both celebrating homecoming. homecoming. Yeah. Third down and five. And uh, timeout Out. east. East? Yeah. East. Also coming off the field for the timeout, Joshua Grauman in there. We mentioned that uh, North will host Oshkosh North next week. East is going to host Manitowoc Lincoln. Uh, WSCS will be out at uh, KLC when they play the Chilton Tigers. To win a new outdoor sports complex and weight room, and you can help us win. There are two mobile yards. Joe, thanks for helping out. I really appreciate this. Was fun. I thanks for asking me. I I now have a great appreciation for the efforts that you make. Oh, thank in, you. In doing these games and 
you know, doing all of the leg work and that, it's it's really impressive. I I gotta say, I'm <laughs> impressed. <laughs> yeah, right. Oh, here's a. Oh, Got him. getting the sack for Sheboygan North was Joshua Grauman. Mm. He came in almost untouched. Taken down. He likes it that way. That's real game. Loss of 10. Another sack for North. I think that's at least their third. Third one, yeah. Fourth and a bunch. Also have new return men back there. Uh, Blake Becker. And uh, can't catch the number. I think it's uh, number five, oh, cool. Dayton Petrowski. North calls time. Uh, even getting the... Uh, Reserves in for special teams. That's nice. I remember the one time Glenn and I, we were returning punts, and uh, I think it was one of the Appleton schools, and they ran a fake. So we run up. The wide receiver <laughs> runs right by us, <laughs> catches a long pass. He didn't score. I think there was a penalty on the play. Oh. So Neiman, Marty, you and Hippo, out. Ottman, Rick, Rick you, or Peterson, you guys go in. <laughs> I was going to wonder what Coach Neiman said about that. <laughs> Not much, except sit down. Hippo, just for the uh, people watching, is Glenn Hilpertshauser. He was the uh, individual that came up in the booth at halftime and mentioned about flag day. 14 first half penalties. Got a bunch in the second, and there is another. Uh, that's number. Well, we aren't going to say who committed that's, the offside. That's the gunner again, trying to get. Was it? I thought it was yeah, uh, one it of the interior like linemen. No, I thought the, the, the guy on the outside. Took Give out. us the replay on that, Scott. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think we're going to get it. Old Vic coming back after shooting t shirts up in the stands. High snap. And the kick is away. Get away. Yeah, really. <laughs> oh, why is that? That was not good. Well, you got to know football. Yeah. Not a smart move by the Raiders. A Raider. Yeah. Shay, what's your last name? Shay Burnett. We're going to give out a secret, Shay. You're the old Vic. <laughs> Good looking kid too. Yeah, a lot of credit for wearing that uh, rubberized or whatever it is yeah. head. I was trying to uh, talk Shay to be an A1 next summer. <laughs> He's gonna look into that. He's got mascot experience. Exactly. Put that, put that down on your resume. Run up the middle, good pounding by North. Gained about five, five yards, yards by the running back. I think that was uh, Aaron Bayona. This is a true test of a play-by-play -play man when you get a whole new wave of players in there to keep track of. It's nice to have an updated roster. <laughs> <laughs> the roster yeah. for East was from 19 or from 2022. And we got a false start. If my record keeping is correct, it's the uh, sure eighth it penalty on North. And that quarterback is Sam Olson. Sam did some quarterbacking uh, last week at uh, Sheboygan South. Three wide receivers off to the right. Olsen shoveled out to Brunette and a uh, good tackle. What a stick made that time. That tackle was made by Isaiah Lyons. Oh, damn. And we're running at the end of the third quarter, seven seconds left. 
That'll do it for uh, the third quarter. And uh, at the end of the third quarter, it's Sheboygan North, 46, East, 6. How do you know when you've made the right decision? It's the feeling you get in your gut, the one that tells you what's right or wrong. It's the one that says, sure, I can have a drink. Or the feeling that says, okay, I've been drinking, now what? It's the voice inside you that says, I'm buzzed, better leave the car when it's time to go. Plan ahead, catch us override. Buzz driving is drunk driving. Back at uh, North High School getting ready to start the fourth quarter. It's going to be third down and uh, 11, 12, 12 yards. yards. We'll go with you, Joe. That's what's on the scoreboard. Yeah. <laughs> I can read. High snap. Handoff to uh, the man running the reverse, but uh, East was guess, on to it. Guess what? I think there was another flag. Brennan Sullivan on the carry. The official from the far side dropped a flag. Might have fell out of his pocket. Uh, They've no. been throwing it so much. <laughs> <laughs> Forget to tuck it back in. That's against North. Procedure or a lineup offside. Procedure. Oh, boy. That's uh, one department where East is winning. I got them for uh, 10, and that's not, they probably got more. North has nine. Late place. to the party is uh, Brennan Sullivan. You were gonna say? No, I was gonna say that North has gotta clean those penalties up and uh, Hey, they got uh, three wide receivers off to the right. Sam Olson takes the snap, dropping back. Oh, he's, he's got, got a man wide, wide open, open, and he makes the catch. He's going to go all the way for a touchdown. 51 yards. Whoa, boy. He laid that out there beautifully. Fabian Bratz. Yeah, he being brats for the touchdown. What number was he? Uh, number 20. Okay, Bobby. Let's go, Bobby. 51 yards. Oh, Gosh, got up Here we go. Yes. Yeah. Look at that. Great running catch. Kept his balance. Sweetness. North doesn't pass much, but when they do, it's pretty efficient. That kind of reminds me of uh, Oklahoma back in the day. Remember with their wishbone? <laughs> yeah, they wouldn't throw much either. Kick is good. Good job by uh, Conrad. 51-yard pass. Very, very nice. Oh, well, that gives something for Oshkosh North to think about. North is well, not think, just a running I team. I don't think they're going to see number 16 <laughs> very much. <laughs> Sam Olson. But the play is in the book. Yeah, exactly. Hey, you know, if they do their homework, gosh, gosh, North, they're going to know about that 73-yarder yeah. last week. That was just a case of speed, you know, winning out. Nice to be young. You know, if we're out there running and catch that ball, we'd fall flat on our face. <laughs> I don't know what I do now call running. <laughs> I tell people if, if they see me running, they better get away because there's a fire behind me. Yeah, right. <laughs> Bunchy Woods back there. Return this uh, kickoff by... Uh, Blake Burr. 
On the ground. Line drive. Picked and up he and steps out of bounds. That will prevent a return. Mm -hmm. Josiah John on uh, the pickup. Not much of a return. Yeah. That was like a chip shot in golf. Well positioned. Had you would know about that. <laughs> You're a good, good golfer. Had a little backspin on I was a good golfer. Hey, was it uh, the other day when I was doing very well? Didn't you have a 40? Yeah. If you'd make a putt, you'd add in the 30s. <laughs> uh, yeah. Ifs and buts. No, I, I enjoy playing golf, especially with, with friends and, and the camaraderie. At my age, that's all I got to look forward to. <laughs> Oh, we got a left-hander, Bobby Douglas. Oh, fumble. Yeah, and he was running and with it and just it, dropped it. Yeah. Josh and Pittman, according to my roster. Did he get it back? Uh, it looks. Uh, there's a lot of people on the field. Oh, We're trying to figure changing, it out. They're changing the stick, so yeah, North, North recovered. recovered it. Here we go. <laughs> yep. Yeah, 88. Yeah, number 88. That is... Owen Engstrom. Engstrom. Good play, Owen. He's in the stat book forever. Fumble recovered. Sorry about that sniffle. My nose is running. Hey, that's okay. It's <laughs> the only thing I got that runs. I'm glad you let the people know it wasn't me. <laughs> It's going to be North Ball on the 33 yard line. Yeah, we got an injured at 32. Down on one knee. I was going to say that's a good sign. The big number 76 for North yeah. is uh, Brady Schultz. Getting, he's walking off a little gingerly. Brady, a 6 1 junior, goes 280. Clock running. Inside handoff. Uh, Didn't fool anybody. No, good job of defense that time by uh, East. At the bottom of the pile was uh, Jordan Vang. Second down and 10. Quick pitch out to... Uh, Good block. Yeah, the running back, uh, Brennan Sullivan, but... but uh, East filled it in well. Yeah, good pursuit. Lost the three. Coming off the field is uh, Landonbury Street. Hope they get Sam Olson back in the game. Let's look for another pass. Olson to Olson. Hand off on the uh, reverse, but a great Good tackle pursuit, made. Yeah. Giovanni hey, Gonzalez. So fourth and 20. Oops. Fourth and 18. Yeah. North going backwards. Fourth down and a bunch. Inside handoff. Good, good job of running, but uh, just too far to go. On the carry that time was uh, Milton Thomas. So East will take over at the 31-yard line. Six and a half minutes left. 
I think it's safe to say that North has got this one. Oh, yeah. <laughs> now it's a matter of don't get anyone hurt and uh, yeah. get ready for uh, next week. They'll be tested next week by uh, Oshkosh North. North winning big up at uh, Green Bay West. I apologize for that erroneous hey, score I gave. Nobody I even remembered that until you brought it up, Joe. <laughs> Admit your mistakes. Uh, what I do want to do, uh, time out by East, is uh, apologize to Green Bay East. Uh, I know a lot of the names I called were incorrect. It was uh, my fault, even though the North High School put the 2022 <laughs> roster on the other side of North's 2024 roster. Uh, but again, you know, it's uh, should have checked that out. And again, Logan, surprise! Thank you for helping me uh, get some of that cleared up. Chris will be back for tomorrow's game at Lakeland. That's a 1 p.m. start. Makes me happy. <laughs> <laughs> it makes me happy. I'll tell you, the left-hander throw is pretty nice. Yeah. Bunchy Woods makes the catch and is dropped after about a five-yard five gain. North's defense all night has been excellent at uh, getting to the ball uh, with more than just one tackler. Bunchy had a 45-yard reception earlier in the game at... Uh, did not result in a score, but uh, he's showing some explosiveness. Deep, going deep That's down the field. Not a very good pass. And uh, the ball is... I think it's incomplete. Look like it. It did bounce out of the receiver's hands. It's but whether he, he was able to catch it. He before. Got it yes, back. he did. Huh? He did make the catch. Twenty-five yard play, play. Twenty-five yard play. Didn't catch who the receiver I didn't was. Either. The ball looked like it was floating a bit. Receiver came back to get it. Yep, that was a nice play by him. Another quick out I and uh, Woods was uh, running with it before he caught it. Well, that's uh, pretty good for East. You know, they had that 45-yard rece reception, now 25 here. Mm -hmm. I like the way uh, that lefty throws. Now, according to hey, my been roster, it's all uh, of his Josh Pittman. Yeah, you're right. Very accurate. We could just go with Bobby Douglas. <laughs> Oh, Chicago Bears reference. Nice drop. Here goes a deep one. Deep one. And, and making a catch. Oh. And scoring for Green Bay East is number five, Josiah John. Another well-thrown ball. I don't know why East is, didn't use them earlier. Yeah, exactly. Yep, that is a 35-yard reception for a touchdown. For uh, John, I've got that as his uh, third reception for uh, 43 yards and a touchdown. They are going for two. Yeah, they did that in the after the first touchdown, too. John, Quarterback keeper. Yeah, Douglas is not going to make it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what, what are you going to do? Good. I'll let you have that Bobby Douglas reference. With the score, uh, Green Bay East now with 12 points. 53 to 12.
The impact of a meal goes well beyond feeding our bodies. Because when people are fed, futures are nourished. Everyone deserves to live a full life. And with your help, together we can end hunger. Join the movement at feedingamerica.org slash act now. Green Bay East getting ready to uh, kick off after that. Uh, looks like it's a nice pass Defend play. for an onside kick. And eight men up within. You know, Pittman is uh, throwing the ball five times. Joan has uh, four, four, in, four completions. Four and a touchdown. Yeah. 10, 20, 30, Oop. 40, 50, 60, <laughs> 70 yards. That didn't work. Onside kick try. <laughs> it, it didn't get past the 40. Oops. <laughs> I think North he was trying, trying to kick one of those high bouncers and it just didn't bounce. No luck. It's been that kind of season. Clock so running. This uh, could very well be the last possession. I would hope so. I, I don't think North is going to do anything but run. Late to the party. was uh, Fabian Bratz. Come on, Fabian. Inside handoff. And I think we've got a flag thrown in the middle of the play. Diana carried the ball. Stop by Isaiah Reigns. I don't think so. I hope not. <laughs> Carry was by Aaron by Biona. Other inside hand. No, pitch out. Oh, pitch, yeah. And uh, Ryan Sandberg on, I mean, Cade Highfire. <laughs> you didn't miss that, Ajo. I did. I got to admit, I was following the guy up the middle. No, you forgot what I called him, number 23. Cade Hightire. I, I, is it Hightire? Or Hightire. High, yeah, now you're right, Hightire. Nice run that time by High. I'm glad you said I was right about something. Oh, you're right about most things. <laughs> I got somebody that'll disagree. <laughs> At home? Yeah. Kate on the nice run. Inside handoff to uh, Aaron Bayona. Aaron is a 5'9 senior, goes 180. He's got a bunch of carries today. Down to a minute 45. Oh, penalty. Oh, gosh. Clock continues to run on that. If they're uh, as diligent as they've been over the other 20 flags, it'll take till the end of the game to yeah. give us the signal. Thanks, Logan. Good luck, you guys. Have a safe trip home. This looks like against East. Ooh. Add to my list of uh, penalties. You're running out of paper? <laughs> we always got another column to use. We'll kind find like a play. We'll find baseball. a place. Yeah. Now, we had two turnovers for East in the first half. Did they have any this half? I think there was a fumble. You know, recovery. I think you said That's two right. fumbles and an interception, so it would have been three. Three. And there was a fumble recovery in this half. So that's four. One in from got there. Does it jump around? So first and goal. 20 seconds. And count. And we got another penalty. 
Oh my. <laughs> that one on east. East, yeah. Another, Another one? Well, it won't matter. It's over. And uh, clock running out, and that's it. A final here at uh, Sheboygan North High School, their homecoming game. North over east, 53 to 12. Uh, Joe, some of your uh, observations about Sheboygan North. I'll go back to what I said at the beginning. They run the ball well and put a lot of pressure on defense. Um, just do a lot of good things right. And it, it shows on the scoreboard. Um, All righty, with that. There's old Vic takes yeah. a run. <laughs> I like this tradition that's going on right now. It, uh, it, it's, a, it's a good thing to do. The tradition of shaking hands with your opponent, saying nice game. Um, it, it's, it's good. All right, so North a winner, 53-12. to 12. Uh, North's next game will be uh, hosting Oshkosh North. Uh, we will be at KLC when they host the uh, Chilton Tigers. For the crew, Richard Bartson, Greg Zablocki on camera, Eric Wiesman on graphics, our director, Scott Mailoff, and for my partner, Joe Gulig, I'm Mike, Mar Mike Martin saying thanks for watching, everybody, and we'll see you down the road. Thanks, Mike.